I applied to stuff. The penguin. A <laughs> ton of R. It amazes me that R and MATLAB are still in use. It's 2022, just use Python. Is where you apply. Yeah, I did one job interview. I just applied to Google and that was it. And everything was all goes. See a murderous penguin we pick it, indeed. Oh hey. One of the best ones. <laughs> you greedy, greedy Dracula. Definitely supposed to take that. Um. What a monster! I'm the one who waddles. Matt Lad is kept new solely by old science fresh professors and professionals. Her entire geophysical job is built solely on extremely important software written by some professor 15 years ago. Sounds right to me. I was gonna say at least it's not Fort Ren, but <laughs> in a lot of cases it is still Fort Ren. Or Tram. You learned what your stats on? Yeah, same. For whatever reason, my stats class was an R. And then every time I've needed to do stat stuff. Afterwards, I just imported SciPy. <laughs> or pandas. Um... Just minimize the odds of the stag getting sniped. Hey, you reddish. Well, don't know why I even bother buying the bossy. They're still fine. I'm probably supposed to buy this XP. It's just so boring. I want to waddle. Mother never tired, made tons of money because she knows COBOL. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> was the professional world 15 years ago when they used R, so that's what they know. Yeah. I mean, my professor is pretty young. I don't know. I don't think I ever had a class that used Python, other than the ones that were language agnostic. There were a ton of Java classes. And there was like random arcane shit like VHDL. see the point of that. It just seems like you're spending the first, what, like, week of the class figuring out the, the syntax of the various languages. I could see, like, like, I took a programming languages class that was kind of cool. We used, like, four or five different languages from different families. Oh, hey, Ryza. Glad you're enjoying the YouTube content. Like, there are some weird practical languages out there. What was... 
was the one that had built-in backtracking? Uh... Prologue. That was such a weird language to use. Please waddle, game. Okay, I guess that's something. Puzzle room? No. Puzzle room? And I still think I want this. Place you gotta go. He's the one you need to know. Um I'm just gonna take a level five, I think. I don't know. I mean, yeah, just give me a Jack Saber. My board's a little weak. I'll take staff. It's awkward. I kind of want to take that upgrade more to upgrade the stag than to cash out the map. The difference between an upgraded stag and an unupgraded stag is kind of crazy. Not a Dracula saber. Boy, I think about problem solving. Yeah. I don't know if I'd ever use Prologue for anything, but it was a cool way to think about problems. Larger than go. The lecture which is turning out to basically be a math lecture. The professor assured us if we ever do research, there would always be physicists. <laughs> Or two. If it's upgraded. I'm not buying. I really I don't really want Aeon. Guess I can go for more neons, or I can just go to six. Going to six seems pretty good. I'm the one who waddles.
Good staff of the old toad. This isn't even that bad. Something behind Stag. Oh, I should. It, it's a ghost fight. I'm just not worried about it. you jumped into. We've been jumping all over the place. It started talking about algos, and now we're on like programming languages and math. True. <laughs> that was a very fun fact. Got a lot of content out of that fun fact. Q is finally understanding why complex numbers exist. Wait, don't you learn that in like high school algebra? Or is it just like another layer to it? Need some lordies. Gimme, give gimme give lordies. Extra layers, you can get any real valued coefficients for a polynomial. And the factors that would correspond to how the system behaves. Sure. So it's just like applications and showing how it ties into real world stuff. What is an answer? Okay, what if you can't factor that? I thought it did a little, but maybe I'm misremembering. It's been a long time. That was me with uh, Calc 2. I don't know how I passed Calc 2. Yeah, true, true. Also linear. I don't know how I passed linear. That professor canceled every other class. <laughs> we did not learn anything in linear, which is really disappointing. place any of these. I guess I could deck over hat. Calc 2 is the best one. Calc 1 was great. I had a great professor for Calc 1. Calc 2, I did not remember anything after the exams. And then I thankfully didn't have to take Calc 3. Mix Neon. Why? I don't think I want to waste the gold. Excel does do a lot of math. Lordy. Yeah, for one turn. No fight that I'm winning anyway. Okay, can I, like, get some more lordies? I do have the staff of the old toad. I'd settle for Tweedles. I don't want angries. Come on, game. 
please. stuff so you don't garbage in garbage out it yeah that's true like that's the ideal right the college is teaching you how to solve problems rather than teaching you about specific problems going back to like the sudoku solver like it's not very practical to like know how to solve a sudoku and using various algorithms but it is important to like, know the theories behind those algorithms and what you can apply them to. huge fan of electronics games, but I thought they'd be around forever. Time expired. Yeah, but I needed to fill my board. That's what I was talking about, how I wanted to be able to rope it, but I put myself in a spot where I couldn't. Still not Ambrosia. <laughs> That's crazy. Just take this so I have a full board. You know what? That's fine. Not even upset. I'm not a fan. I mean, I've never played a Zactronics game for more than 25 minutes before getting bored. <laughs> Let me make sure that that's true. Let me look at their library. I played TIS 100 for like 20 minutes. I don't even know if I played Space Chem for 10 minutes. And I haven't tried the rest of them. To get through the trivial stuff to get to the good parts. But why? I don't know. The way I thought about it is why am I doing why am I playing these Zectronics games instead of just like doing Project Euler problems, which are in a better programming language and basically as interesting. real projects. I mean, yeah. But I could just do the unwinding in a real programming language instead of whatever uh, esoteric thing that they make for a graphical programming language in the game. Worst language and other limitations are part of the appeal. Yeah, I'm saying I don't get that appeal. Like, it's just not for me. So greedy for spell. I feel like that's just wasting a gold. I don't know. The dream is what? Like, obviously, like, Knighthood or a combat spell, but there's a lot of junk you can get. Is that a 
Position one apple tree. Thank you, Dorfs. Still not 5k. 